Work on that gratitude guy. Don't complain, be grateful. So I started thinking about this. I talk a lot about gratitude, of course, and being grateful. And I thought we are human, and I thought, you know, there's certain characteristics that we want to work on every day, but there is a balance. I spoke yesterday or the day before about moderation. But what about taking complaining and replacing it with gratitude? And here's what happened. I was recently, where I live, it rains a lot. So I was down at uh, the local coffee shop, I think it was a Starbucks, and I heard this gal complaining, and it was the rain, and it was the clouds, and it was the overcast, and it was drizzle, and she was just complaining about, you know, this, this, and that. And I thought, well, okay, again, we're human. I know that uh, I can't have a great day every single day. I sure try to. I certainly have a grateful day every day, but uh, sometimes you have a good and a bad day. That's just part of life. Well, a couple of weeks later, it was really a beautiful day. It was probably 75, 80 degrees, just beautiful. And I happened to be at the same uh, coffee shop. And I spotted the same gal, and the gal gets her coffee and says, how you doing? She goes, it's so hot. This heat, gosh, I'm sweating. I'm just telling you. And I started silently laughing to myself, going, wait a second. You can't have it both ways. You can either complain about the rain, but you can't complain about the sun. Or it's too hot. Oh, this heat. And so I thought, you know, again, I understand we're human, but we do have choices. And you can complain or you can be grateful. And I'm, I'm saying consider replacing complaining with gratitude. Every time you're about to complain, think about everything you're grateful for. Many years ago, I've spoken about my father many times now. I consider myself a pretty positive person. Unfortunately, my father was a very negative person. We're having a, a little coffee at a coffee shop, and he is just, just complaining and moaning and bitchy. Oh, my goodness, everything that was wrong. And I'm just listening to it, sipping on my cup of coffee. And I finally looked at him, and I said, you know, you complain a lot. Gosh, and I'm going to guess I was in my 20s or maybe late teens, something like that. And uh, I said, you know, all you do is complain. I, I used the example once. I say, good morning. He says, what's good about it? So I'm listening to him complain and complain. And finally, I stopped him. I said, you know, I'm just really tired of your complaining. Why do you complain so much? And he goes, well, did it ever occur to you? Maybe I just like to complain. I thought about it for a second. And I said, well, did it ever occur to you? I just may not want to hang around you. I mean, even though I'm your son, I don't want to be subject to that stuff. Life is stressful enough without people adding on to it by complaining. So think about being grateful. Think about replacing complaining with gratitude. And be sure you're writing in that gratitude journal. Because as I've said so many times, that act of writing puts it in your brain. And it reframes and refocuses your outlook for the day, for the week, and for, for uh, all the time forward. As you're thinking about everything that's going to happen to you in the future. Have a grateful day. Try not to complain today. Think about being grateful instead. Be sure you're writing in that gratitude journal. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow.